Hello and welcome to Let's Play Minecraft with me, Sasma. In this episode, I will be um, showing you what you need um, for like a big expedition and just gathering supplies for a big expedition in a few videos' time. Now, as you, as you hopefully watched, I went mining um, last video and just gathered some well, supplies. And now I will be slowly building up my supplies in my inventory so that we can make an expedition somewhere. Now, I won't be able to cover it all in this video, so some parts I will say what you need, but I'll get it later because half the time I would have probably forgotten what I need to get. Alright, so you need you need some wood of course so that you can build anything you're there while you're there so like beds etc as you can see a creeper just blew up part of my face so I'll fix that later so if you get like a stack of wooden blocks so 64 wooden blocks then that should hopefully last you and if you don't want to and you well, yeah you just don't want to get all this wood then you could bring an axe spare and just get it along the way but you're never sure if you're going to be in a desert or something with less and less trees so Well, not just because of my um, axe breaking. I think I'm going to keep half a stack and then just get another axe and build it later. But, yeah. We'll get some before. You don't really want to see me getting wood all the time. Alright, so you want a good amount of wood. Um, You want around half a stack of coal as well. Just... Because, just so that you don't run out of supplies at your base, but you've got enough to go on. You also probably want some saplings because then you can build the trees. And if you get some bone meal from skeletons, then you can make the trees quicker and it just helps a lot. You want some stone, and because of the amount of stone I've got, I'll bring an entire stack. Um, and now comes your tools again. Well, firstly, again, half of this make into planks, and then you want a crafting table with you. and you want a furnace with you so that you can make food on the way now you don't really need dirt or anything like that so but we do need wool so that we can make our beds etc um, we'll need a bucket need anything else from here take take the flint as well so we can make flint and steel actually Right, I've got a fish in here. Actually, I'll make a flint and steel quickly. Oh. This means you can just set things alight, and you, it's an well, it's an unlimited f um, heat light source, but it doesn't really give that that much. I've now forgotten which ones I've. Put them in. Oh, there you go. Right, 
yeah that is a problem with leaving your food and stuff in these you do suddenly run out now I think that's enough food for now because as I said you will be going out and you will be hunting, hunting quite a lot because there will be a lot of that now if we bring the string that means we can make our fishing rods again we'll probably want a chest don't need the flint anymore now, I don't know why I've only got a stone sword I'll, I will try to fix that but I don't know why um, So yeah, um, you want to start building up your armour, but I can't seem to find any iron at the moment, so. Now, if you get two chests, you'll be able to make a long, la longer chest, which is just help, so helpful. And you can stack it all, so it's, yeah. Um, the reason why you want to carry spruce wood or just wood and instead of wooden planks is because they take up less space so it just means you can well you just don't need as much the same with if you same with make a bed now then you would if I didn't want to bring the wool and stuff you would leave, you wouldn't lose lots now you also want a map and you might want a compass um, but I will make them away from video and I might also download a map a um, mod called rise mini map and it is literally a mini map but it's a lot more detailed than the minecraft standard one which will help you find your places quite easier I go I'll check okay now we've had don't bring anything you really don't want to lose so any like diamonds or anything through this unless you're experienced or a bit mad because if you lose it unless you've made a spawn point near that you probably won't get it back Now I think that's it for this Minecraft, um, I will try and get a map and stuff before my next video, thank you and goodbye.